Today we take on the African continent, scoping its artistic landscape for the very best African painters you need to know. The decolonization of the African nations in the post-war era resulted in a period of substantial change and upheaval. As a result, a highly interesting socio-political climate arose for contemporary African art to prosper. African artists have taken the responsibility to define, write, and in this case, paint their own history and identity. So, we are pleased to present you the 10 most influential contemporary African painters. Number 10, Basim Magdi. We start our list in Egypt, in Asiat to be more precise, where Basim Magdi was born in 1977. The Egyptian artist works in painting, drawing, sculpture, video and installation, in which he seems to be in a quest for the absurd. Magdi creates dream-like paintings, combining familiar elements from our direct environment, while juxtaposing them with absurd elements which are out of this world. Bright colors and an almost science fiction feeling to it, his painterly oeuvre distinguishes itself strongly, with its surreal and aggressive quality. The contemporary artist currently works between Basel, Switzerland, and Cairo, Egypt. Number 9, Adele Abdesame. We remain in North Africa, where we encounter a neo-conceptual painter. Born in 1971 in Constantine, Algeria, Adele Abdesame currently works and resides in Paris, France. Abdesame creates deliberate actions, or acts by everyday objects or materials which are documented by videos, photographs and more. Afterwards, the Algerian French artist aims to create a remainder of this specific act, resulting in sculptures or paintings. Number 8, Whale Shorky. Further, we head towards Alexandria, Egypt, where Whale Shorky was born in 1971, and continues to work and live. Shorky is another neo-conceptualist, implementing contemporary painting in his multidisciplinary practice. The starting point for his works is an extensive period of research, before tackling notions of national, religious, or artistic identity. He frames contemporary culture, using the prism of historical culture. His painterly oeuvre is marked by bright colors, magical scenes, and a very critical undercurrent. Number 7, Njideka Akinyali Crosby. Born in Enugu, Nigeria, in 1983, Njideka Akinyali Crosby is a Nigerian-American painter, living and working in Los Angeles. Crosby moved to the United States of America in 1999. However, her cultural identity is strongly defined by her country of birth, resulting in a so-called hybrid identity, which is a key aspect of her painterly oeuvre. Crosby draws inspiration from art historical, political and personal references. Her figuratively rendered paintings conjure the complexity of our contemporary existence and experience. Interiors, everyday life, and social gatherings are key themes throughout her impressive body of works. However, the artist creates a series of visual interventions by implementing a vibrant effect of patterns and photo collages derived from Nigerian culture, popular culture, or the collective memory. Number 6, Kendall Gears. We head south to Johannesburg, where we encounter none other than Kendall Gears. Born in 1968 in Johannesburg, South Africa, Kendall Gears is a neo-conceptual artist, living and working in Brussels, Belgium. His multidisciplinary practice is marked by the use of language, ready-mades, neon, glass, film, chevron tape, or film, resulting in minimalist aesthetics with a poetic character. Painting is an important facet of his artistic practice, implementing the aforementioned elements on a two-dimensional surface. He questions value in art, often mocking the notion of originality. He takes on racial or religious stereotypes, with sharp humor, questioning moral codes or political implications. Number 5, Wangechi Mutu. We head towards Nairobi, Kenya, where none other than Wangechi Mutu was born in 1972. The African contemporary painter currently lives and works in New York City. Mutu takes on various media, encompassing sculpture, collage, film, installation, and first and foremost, painting. The African female artist explores violence and misrepresentations afflicting contemporary women. Her distorted feminine forms take on contemporary issues such as globalization, consumerism, inequality, and the continuous search for a new balance between tradition and contemporary life. Number 4, Michael Armitage. 
Up next we have another virtuoso from Nairobi. Born in 1984 in Nairobi, Kenya, Michael Armitage is a contemporary painter living and working between London, the United Kingdom, and his hometown. He is best known for his figuratively rendered oil paintings, painted on a traditional bark cloth from Uganda called Lubugo. Drawing inspiration from historical events and contemporary media, Michael Armitage combines narratives from both spheres. At the center of his artistic practice, one encounters the visual iconography of East Africa. Doing so, Armitage takes on the harsh reality of East Africa, encompassing political issues, violence, inequality, and extreme disparities in wealth. Number 3, Julie Meritu. We open our top three with the one and only Julie Meritu. The Ethiopian-American artist was born in 1970 in Addis Ababa, and currently resides and works in New York. Her monumental paintings can be interpreted as abstract landscapes, using an array media on various surfaces, inspired by architectural plans, photography, city maps, and more. One encounters calligraphy or street art, in her two-dimensional works with an eclectic character. Meritu aims to examine history in relation to our urban environment, and its socio-political effects. The female artist chooses markers, paint brushes, spray cans, pencils, or screen printing as her weapons of choice for these dazzling tableaus. Number 2, Marlene Dumas. Up next, we travel to Cape Town, South Africa, where none other than Marlene Dumas was born in 1953. Dumas currently works and lives in Amsterdam, the Netherlands, but remains strongly connected to her home in Cape Town. Dumas is one of the undoubted most famous painters today. She depicts sensually painted figures, taking on often thought-provoking subjects. The starting point for almost any painting is collected found imagery, or images of her direct environment. Doing so, she evokes first-hand emotions, with second-hand images, examining what is universal, collective, and what is personal at the same time. Number 1, William Kentridge. We top of our list with arguably the most important African artist today. Born in 1955 in Johannesburg, South Africa, William Kentridge continues to work and reside in Johannesburg. One might argue Kentridge is rather a draftsman or printmaker than a painter. However, due to the expressive character of his works, and the ease with which he switches from surface to surface, it is clear to say the distinction between painting and drawing seems to disappear with the South African master. With Kentridge, painting or drawing becomes a process of recording history. He reconfigures fragments of the past, resulting in a greater understanding of African history, but also of himself, concluding our article in style. Make sure to watch our video on the seven most exciting emerging artists in 2022 next, and feel free to consider subscribing to our channel for more contemporary art. See you soon.